It's destiny. I ditch all these parts before we crash, we find the gravestone, and then what do we need to get it flying? Honestly, it's plain as day. Not for Lana, though. For her, it's all just skill and luck and coincidence. Relying on fate to get you out of trouble will always leave you disappointed. Better to rely on yourself. I can't believe you two. Just wait and see. I know I'm right on this. Lana's told me about all the things you've done. More than once. Half the reason I agreed to this crazy rescue was to see if you were actually real. So, I figure I know all about your past. You deserve to know mine. Lana might have told you I was the captain of a warship during Arkin's campaign against the Core Worlds. My crew and I deserted, but I'm not going to pretend we didn't do our share of damage beforehand. Just thought you should hear it from me. Lana mentioned that you deserted instead of following orders. What was the order? We were holding territory on Denon. Locals rioted and orders were to open fire until they stopped. None of us even wanted to be there. Massacring civilians? That's not how Zakul is supposed to operate. Thank you for being honest with me. You and your crew made the right choice. Glad you think so. One more thing, as long as we're being honest. When you risked your life to shut that generator down, you showed me that you're someone I can count on. I want to take Arkin down, but we don't have to take down all of Zakul with him. I'm glad to know you understand that too. Too many innocent people have suffered already. I'm not going to add to that. Thank you. Come on. Let's get this stuff back to the gravestone. Request. Please rendezvous at my current coordinates at your earliest convenience, masters. I require assistance. Plastic droid. <laughs> 